<laughs> Almost. Almost. Well, welcome to the latest episode of Your Comments. First of all, thank you so much to the thousands of you that responded with your comments for Samir. And we are delighted to have the man himself here today. Thank you, Samir. You're welcome. Uh, we've had, as we say, thousands of comments. Kelly and I have chosen what we think to be the best uh, 12 of the bunch. Some good ones. Some in gems here. in here. So we'll kick off with <laughs> Harry Hutchinson. Harry, uh, he asks, do you like snails, frogs, legs and baguettes? P.S. I am not good at French, so sorry for the spelling. Baguettes wrong. Uh, I like baguettes. Yeah. Uh, um, snails and frog legs, to be honest, I never tried them. And I'm not looking into trying them because I heard really that is really good, but it's not something that like I want to do. Not something you're up for? No. Nah. Even though you own a restaurant, you've told us. Yeah, but it's not something that uh, I want to try. Like, I don't know, I don't know. Yeah, uh, like, just not up for it. Yeah, no, <laughs> <laughs> it's just too much. Uh, does your restaurant sell them? Snails and frogs legs? No, no, I don't want that, no, no, no. French no, no. Oh, okay, no. right. <laughs> well, there we go. Uh, John Hilaire, do you listen to Celine Dion? <laughs> uh, I listen to a bunch of music, to be honest, Celine Dion. I'm not uh, a fan, even if I like a couple of... Uh, Singles, but oh, so you do you do like a little bit of Celine Dion? Yeah, the song that she made for Titanic was great. But lately, no, I've, I haven't been listening to to her music. But yeah, I like all kind of music. Is there a particular genre, or do you have a favorite album of all time? Uh, favorite album of all time? Uh, it was uh, Chronic 2001 from Dr. Dre. Uh, I, I remember because I was at the academy, uh, mm. skip school to go and uh, buy the album. And do I'm do that? <laughs> kids watching. No, don't do that. Do <laughs> no. Stay kids. Yes, but <laughs> it was just such a, a great album, and uh, for me, it will be like it will stay for the for the best album of all time. Okay, Matthew Jennings asks, do you think you should listen to your heart? or your head when making huge career changing decisions? And, uh, and I don't know, I just listen to everything that comes, uh, you know, the way I feel. Because um, sometimes uh, if you want um, if you want to be the, the perfect, uh, the perfect player who doesn't uh, get into trouble and stuff, you need to listen to your and uh, not your heart. But the problem is, if you get frustrated and you keep it to yourself and you don't express your, your, your feeling, one day it's just gonna explode to the wrong person. The person that you love, your family, your friend, and explode on them and then something, you know, you can have like bad consequences. So I'd rather be like someone honest who tells how I feel to my manager, if I have problem to my, with my manager, to my teammate, but at least uh, we know where we stand and I don't hurt people that I, I care for. Kevin Benilla, if you were stuck on an island, would you rather be with the two most beautiful women in the world or have Mangala and Sanya by your side? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> if I'm stuck in an island? Mm. Okay, and there is no coming back? Let's presume there's not. Uh, I love you guys. Uh, I'm gonna go with the two girls. <laughs> <laughs> Sonia chose you, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> when we asked him this question the other week, yeah. Who, what, who or what would you take on a desert island? Yeah. <laughs> I, can, I changed my comment, sorry. I take back and the two girls. Um, I can take them too, it's fine. I think I will have a chance to put up a girl, it's fine. They can all go, they can all go. <laughs> Petri Van Halle says, what places would you show someone who's never been to France and why? Uh, Marseille, <laughs> because I'm from Marseille. No, necessarily, uh, most, it's a really nice city, Marseille, but if someone never been to France, that person should go to Paris. Uh, because uh, it's a city with a uh, lot of history, uh, it's a city of love, 
and there is so many things to, to see. Uh, Frederick Ashun, Samir, is it true that you're the most fashionable player in the team? I don't know. I don't know. I, I have. I, I really have like advice about the clothes. I like uh, fashion. I like the fashion world. So I try to be, uh, you know, to be in. And the thing is, uh, if you ask some players, they're gonna say that. But I will be a little bit uh, too uh, too cocky for me to say that. Probably aren't many players that can pull off those leather pants. <laughs> 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 and also, I have uh, a prop. Yes, I, I, I mean... Do you recognise this hat? <laughs> <laughs> Although yours was black. <laughs> it was black, it was a little bit bigger. We so. found this in the office, we were like, that's the maze hat. No, it was, it was bigger and... It was quite a big rim on that. If you want, I can, uh, I can bring it tomorrow and you can wear it. Hey, let's do this. Let's do, I, I don't know if I could uh, wear it well, I'll be honest. <laughs> okay, Cole, um, if your life was a movie, which actor would play you? I would love, <laughs> if I choose, I would love, uh, I know, now he's too old, we're going to play in my life. It's okay, he's going to say Al Pacino. Right? Yeah, Al Pacino, <laughs> sure. I knew it. Al Pacino, but then like on our days, I will say Leonardo DiCaprio. Leo? Can, yeah, he yeah. can pay, he can pay. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, Leo, I like him. Get permission. Let me see. Fair hair, isn't it? That doesn't matter if it always dies. Yeah, no, Black. it's it's fine. But I just like you know, if you want to choose someone to uh, to play your character, you just aim for for the best. And I yeah. just think that uh, is the best actor of our generation. Josh Drury, <laughs> if you could have any power, what would it be? Uh, Oh wow, tough one, tough one, uh, give me an idea, what will be yours? I think I would like to be able to either fly or to have the power to be in any place I wanted to. You could just think I'd like to be in Miami or I'd like to be in LA or Dubai and just be there. And you? Um, I'd like to either go into the past or the future. I'm not sure which, but something just to see how things were or how they will be. Just a little glimpse of like, you know. Yeah, me will be a mix, yeah. I like the teleportation one because I can leave somewhere and just come back to training in a minute. Beep. <laughs> Train. <laughs> see you tomorrow. Beep. I go wherever I want to go. And going to the past, but then really in the past, past to see how life was. Because I don't want to change anything that I did in my life. I, I don't need my life to have regret, so I don't want to change anything about it. I take my decision, like, because at some point I thought that it was the right one. Uh, but yeah, only like to see like how our ancestors were living at the time and stuff like that, then yeah. Okay, um, Lisa Milling, Samir, how much did you love punching the corner flag after your Derby Day goal? Uh, I cannot even describe it because it was kind of a... First of all, it's a derby, so it's always important to score in a derby. Uh, it was a fantastic win for us, uh, for one. And it was kind of a revenge with what happened the year before uh, when I was... Uh, involved in the in the goal from uh, Van Persie so it was just like all of those emotions you know all together and first thing that happened I wanted to punch the, the, <laughs> the corner flag instead of punching someone and get the red card. <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Okay, build a force. Can you lick your elbow? Lick my elbow? <laughs> well, uh, no. No. <laughs> no. Impossible. Yeah, go on, you guys no. have tried there. No. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. 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 I wonder who uh, actually. No. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that one. Build a force. 
can we uh, can we ask him? Build a force. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Build a force. Can you dig your elbow? And if yes, send us a video so we can see. We need evidence because we're not sure it's actually possible. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder how many videos we're going to get now, city fans. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Be inundated. <laughs> Thank you very much for all of your questions, some pretty good ones in there. I think you'll agree to me, yeah? <laughs> yeah, some, some pretty good ones, some funny ones, and uh, really happy to have done it. All right, well, uh, if you at home can lick your elbow, then please send us a video to prove it. Um, in the meantime, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to be among the first to see this video and whether your question made it into this feature. Thanks Thank a lot. You. And thanks to me. Thanks Thank so you. Much. Oh, brilliant. Thank you.